Devin Haney's boxing career is cooked. Is cooked. If you ever heard, Devin Haney is now suing Ryan Garcia for battery and fraud for what happened in the ring when they fought. From the very beginning, Devin Haney hasn't done anything but complain and make excuses why he lost Ryan Garcia. And it just so happened Ryan did pop for PEDs, which is understandable until we realize how much Ryan had in his system. Six billionth of a gram, by the way. It, and it was proven that it was contamination of uh, some supplements he took. But... So be it. That's the rule. Zero tolerance. I'm okay with that. And Ryan was made an example of from the commission. He was suspended for a year, paid a bunch of fines, and the fight itself was switched over to a no contest. Devin Haney became undefeated. But let's be honest. We all saw that beating. No matter what, no matter how much he had in his system or how little he had in his system, Ryan beat the shit out of Devin Haney, and he would do it any day of the week, in my opinion. Now we're here, where Devin Haney is suing Ryan Garcia for battery over a boxing match. The fraud I'm not interested in, whatever. But battery? You're doing nothing but ruining your boxing career. The little bit you've already ruined. You could have bounced back from that loss, to be honest. A real fighter does not sue because he got his feelings hurt over a loss a real fighter wants his payback in blood take Cotto for example when uh, he fought Margarito Margarito had plaster on his wraps literally beating Cotto to death with rocks what did Cotto do? I want a rematch and he beat the dog shit out of Margarito Wilder, another example. He felt he is treated. I don't think he was, but in his heart, he felt he was cheated against Fury. And what did he do? He complained a lot, but he wanted it back in blood. So he got his rematch, and he tried his heart out. And it was a good fight. That was a damn good fight. The third fight, damn good. He lost, but he did what a fighter was supposed to do. Not sell their fight in a courtroom. No, you bring it to the ring. You can get it back in blood. Devin Haney, man, he's not a real fighter. In my opinion. You do something like this. You sue over battery over what happened in the ring. Keep in mind, this is the same man. The same exact man. That jumped a guy at a carnival during the rides. <laughs> No fight experience. He's literally a carnival guy. And you jumped him. That guy didn't sue, did he? No, he didn't, Devin. Maybe you should take some notes from the carnival guy. You jumped him. A world champion. Along with all your people. Jumped this carnival guy. Didn't sue. He had every right to. And you should have been sued. But you're going to sue Ryan Garcia... For a boxing match. Because he has six billionth of a gram of PEDs in his system. After Ryan already was made an example of by the commission. I don't know. I think Devin's career is done. I don't want to see him fight. I don't want to picture him fighting anytime soon. Like who, who cares to fight Devin Haney now? With all this controversy. What well, promoter wants to put him on at risk of losing a lot of money? I wouldn't do it. So yeah, I think Devin Haney's career is done. And he's trying to get the biggest payday he possibly can. Because he knows it's done. He knows he can't continue fighting. So, get what money you can, I guess, is his mindset. For all the fighters out there, if you need new gear, I got you with the hookup. HKAUSA.com You can get all the fight gear you need there. Whether you're MMA or boxing. They have everything you need between gloves, pads, apparel, mouthpiece, wraps, anything you need. HKA has you covered. And I got you with the hookup. 
20% off your purchase with promo code FUN. That's P-H-U-N-N. Get yourself some gear today. Get started whether you're new to the sport or you're a veteran. They have all different budget options for you. Get you some gear. Get some training going on. And don't forget to use the promo code FUN. Anyways, guys, I'll see you guys next time. I'm out.